From the FT in London, here's the latest on markets. The steam came off the Trump trade a little yesterday, but it's back on now and then some. The dollar is up at 13-year highs as investors brace for the US to streak away from the rest of the world with rising inflation and climbing interest rates. Helped by strong jobs and housing data yesterday, the dollar index is now on for its 10th straight day of gains, its longest winning streak in four years. On the flip side, the euro has nudged under 106 to the dollar in its longest losing streak since its inception. Today, European Central Bank Chief Mario Draghi said that with inflation feeble, he's still going to keep the taps running. It'll be interesting to see if and when the euro's slide changes this equation. Meanwhile, the pressure on bonds is back, with gilts now well below their point from before the Brexit vote and bond yields at a lofty 0.3%. Italian bonds are under particular pressure with a referendum coming up there. Gold bugs, meanwhile, are getting squashed. Emerging markets are under strain, especially the rand and the lira. Support for the peso after a Mexican rate rise overnight has proven fleeting.